six weeks um, it is a super dark grey um, haven't really been wearing makeup very much let alone um, slightly outrageous makeup so um, I didn't really wear that um, and, but for me this project was more about just having a bit of fun with stuff not actually um, trying to use anything up um, I'm sorry if you can hear the wind in the background, it just got super windy outside. got to remember, I live in Australia, it's the middle of winter here. Uh, the second one was the NYX Cosmetic Cosmic Metals in Asteroid Aura. This is the lighter purple of the two that are in this actual line. Again, I think I probably wore it once, maybe. <laughs> Um, <laughs> the next one was the Avon Glimmer Sticks in Cosmic Brown. Uh, it doesn't look too much different to what it looked like when I started. I've used it a few times. It just wasn't something that I reached for um, very much. I think I used it once to do um, like a smoky eye and that was pretty much it. Um, then we had the Planet Type eyeshadows from the Makeup Studio. Um, the main one that I've been using is this one here. Um, I used this one and this one in one makeup look and I used quite a bit of this in another makeup look. But that was pretty much it. And because they're baked highlighters, they're like, it's really hard to see any progress. The only one you can see any kind of difference on is this the blue one's kind of like lost its um, hump thing, it's a bit flatter on the top, but other than that they all look exactly the same as they did when I started, which is fine. Um, the only one that shows sort of any kind of difference is actually um, Nebula from the Kat Von D Metal Matte Palette, um, and even then it's, it's tenuous change. <laughs> so it's this one here. There's, you know, signs of wear in it, because it did actually get used a fair bit, actually, um, and what next word got used as well, because it's in another project, um, but yeah, there's signs of use in it, it's a very pigmented, like, it's a pigmented shadow, um, you don't need very much to have a fairly big impact. So it didn't get used a lot, but it did get used and I had fun playing with it. And as a result, because I've had it sitting, this palette sitting next to me, um, because of it, I've used that shade, that shade, that one, that one. I'm using that one and that one. So I've pretty much used all of the non-neutral shimmery shades. Um, and I've used Jet a couple of times. I've used Velour a couple of times and I've used linen a couple of times as well. So um, sticking one of the shadows in meant that I kind of started to play with some of the other ones which was, you know, it's a bit of a change. Um, yeah, so that is my finale for the Revenge of the Fifth uh, Project Pan collab thing. Um, I'll list all the other people who are in it down below. If you want to subscribe, click the button down below. Leave me a thumbs up if you like Project Pan and collab type videos. And leave me a comment down below. I try to respond to all comments and I'll see you in my next video. See ya.